Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, recipes, grocery hauls, and what's for dinner. And I am here today with a, I guess it's a food haul, like a gourmet food haul from World Market. Now, if you're not familiar with World Market, it is a, it's like a, a global retail store. They have furniture and food and goods from all parts of the world. And I happened to stop by mine and they are actually going out of business. So their food was 10% off, which isn't a lot, um, but I, I really like trying different foods, as you know, and so I decided to pick up some stuff. So I'll start over here with this tin. This is a tin of um, really thin ginger snaps, and um, I really like them. And so I think these were like $15, no, I'm sorry, they were $14 and then they were 10% off. And this entire tin is full of thin and crispy ginger snaps. So I grabbed that. The other thing that I picked up are these Hawaiian kettle style potato chips. So for um, our honeymoon, we went to Hawaii and these were a popular chip that they sold around there. And before uh, we left Hawaii and came back home, I went to Walmart and bought a few more bags of their chips. So I was really excited to see them at World Market. I flipped the bag over to see where the chips were manufactured because I just assumed it was Hawaii. And they were made in Washington sadly but anyway they're really good so they were just reminiscent of our honeymoon so i wanted to grab them another thing that i picked up were these um, fresh chow mein noodles and they are three single servings and they come with their own seasoning packet and that sounded really good to me you guys know that howard and i really like asian food and i've never bought any type of these uh any of these types of noodles before so i decided i wanted to try that same thing with these dry noodles um, there is a recipe that I plan on using and it called for these Asian dried noodles, so I decided to pick those up. And then Howard and I, we like hot and spicy. This is a fire chicken sauce, um, a Korean fire chicken sauce, and it sounded good to me, so pick that up. And I've showed this before, Howard really likes this jerk seasoning, and they happen to have that there, so of course I grabbed the bottle because um, he used the last of it making jerk pork. And let's see here. Um, now I have had these Ritter Sports before uh, and I really like them a lot. And I like the cornflake one. I know it sounds weird, but it's kind of the same as eating a Rice Krispie Treat and it's really good, so pick that up. This is something new that I've never seen before. Um, these are brownie crisp cookie thin and they're super thin. Let's see if I can find, there they are. So they're really, really thin and it sounded good to me. So I wanted to give those a try. And then I also picked up these Irish oatmeal biscuits. They look good, see? And they sound like they're gonna be crispy and they're made with Irish butter. And then I saw this little bag of minis, um, Choco minis, and they are like a butter cracker on one side. And then on the other side, they have some milk chocolate and that sounded good. And I really like Haribo um, Coke Goonies, but I've never seen the sour and tangy. So they have, as you can see, like some sugar on top and they're supposed to be fizzy as well. So I was excited about that. Now these I got for Howard. Um, this sounded right up his alley and he was excited when he saw it. These are pineapple rum cashew coconut mix. And there they are, that's what it looks like. So there's pineapple, cashews, cherries, um, what does that say? Oh, rum glaze and toasted coconut. And then I got a couple of different soup kits. This is a Thai coconut soup and you just add water and chicken. And I think on the back, there's a variation for shrimp. Yeah, shrimp, so I'll probably use shrimp with that. And then um, another thing that I saw, <clears throat> excuse me, is this jalapeno cheddar soup and you just add water and milk. That sounded good to me. There's a local fish restaurant around here that has like a creamy jalapeno soup and I really like it a lot and I'm hoping this is very similar to it. 
And then the last thing I picked up are these Clearly Canadians. So I grew up as a child in the 80s and Clearly Canadian was all the rage. And I know that they recently brought Clearly, Clearly Canadian back. So I got all four of the flavors that they had. Um, peach, black, mountain blackberry, wild cherry, and country raspberry. So I'm really excited. I hope it tastes the same as when I was younger. You know how you um, taste something that you haven't had in a while, <clears throat> excuse me, and it just doesn't taste the same? I'm hoping that's not the case, so. Um, so anyway, this is everything that I picked up from World Market. I may try and go back again before they close um, just to see if they've marked down their food even more. But this is it for my haul, short and sweet. I just wanted to share it with you guys. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, I really hope that you'll do so. If you like this video, please make sure to give us a thumbs up and we'll see you guys next time.